Hello, fellow writers. Welcome to my videos and welcome back to Moto Stylist channel. Today, I want to talk about the 2023 Kawasaki vs. 1000 SE LT Plus, a bike that has everything you need to take on the open road. Whether you are looking for performance, comfort, or technology, this bike has it all. Let me tell you why. Performance, the 2023 Kawasaki vs. 1000 SE LT Plus is powered by a smooth and powerful 1043 cubic centimeters inline four-cylinder engine that delivers 75.2 lbft of torque. This engine is paired with a six-speed transmission with Kawasaki Quick Shifter, which allows you to shift up and down without using the clutch. The bike also features Kawasaki electronic control suspension with Showa Skyhook EER8 technology, which automatically adjusts the damping and preload according to the road conditions and riding style. The bike also has an advanced IMU-equipped rider support system that includes integrated riding modes, electronic cruise control, heated grips, cornering ABS, traction control, and more. Price, the 2023 Kawasaki vs. 1000 SE LT Plus has a MSRP of $18,899, which is not cheap but not outrageous either. Considering the features and quality of this bike, I think it is worth every penny. Plus, you get two 28-liter hard saddlebags with KQR mounts, a handguard, and a center stand included in the price. That's a lot of value for your money. Availability, the 2023 Kawasaki vs. 1000 SE LT Plus is expected to hit the dealerships in early 2023. However, due to the high demand and limited supply, you might want to pre-order yours as soon as possible. You can also check out the Kawasaki website for more information and updates. Pros, the 2023 Kawasaki vs. 1000 SE LT Plus is a versatile and capable bike that can handle any type of road and any type of adventure. It has a comfortable upright riding position, a large adjustable windscreen, an all-LED lighting system with cornering lights, a multifunction TFT color LCD screen with smartphone connectivity, and a superb fuel efficiency. It is also a fun and exciting bike to ride, thanks to its smooth engine, quick shifter, electronic suspension, and rider aids. Cons, the 2023 Kawasaki vs. 1000 SE LT Plus is not perfect. It has some drawbacks that you should be aware of before buying it. For example, it is a heavy bike that weighs 566.7 pounds curved weight. It also has a high seat height of 33.1 and that might be challenging for shorter riders. It also has a limited ground clearance of 5.9 and that might limit its off-road capabilities. Conclusion, the 2023 Kawasaki vs. 1000 SE LT Plus is a bike that I would love to own and ride. It is a bike that can do it all, touring, commuting, sport riding, adventure riding, you name it. It is a bike that offers performance, comfort, and technology in one package. It is a bike that will make you smile every time you twist the throttle. If you are looking for a new bike for 2023 that can take you anywhere you want to go, I highly recommend checking out the 2023 Kawasaki vs. 1000 SE LT Plus. You won't regret it. That's all for today's videos. I hope you enjoyed watching it and learned something new. If you have any questions or comments about the 2023 Kawasaki vs. 1000 SE LT Plus, feel free to leave them below. I would love to hear from you. Until next time, ride safe and have fun.